stuck inside on an unnecessarily snowy day, unable to drive the roads because the snow is 10 meters high. Hey guys, name's Finn, playing a game because what else am I gonna do? Loading a game because what else am I gonna do? Yes, so a few people gave me hints. Uh, thanks a lot, guys. Very much appreciated. And so, there are some things that I need to do which I didn't even think of because I didn't remember. Let me take a look at one of these notes. I'll figure out which one it is. Oh, the one I was thinking of was not, <coughs> in fact, here. Oh, lights. However, it was somewhere. There. All right, now it should say something about here an emperor himself pointing toward my words. Okay, so he found that there are notes on the construction contain the bones. Yeah, okay. The emperor. Icon of the emperor pointing and follow his hand motion. Great. That's all it says here. I thought I was going to get some slightly more useful information, but uh, I have to start in a cathedral somewhere. I mean, okay. The cathedral. Let us go. So, I should look for a portrait of an emperor pointing his hand in the cathedral. I guess not in the basement, I guess just in the actual cathedral. So, some of these paintings have got signs by them and I think, I almost want to say that... Oh, I remember, I remember the sign. I remember the sign, the little placard, it said the Emperor pointing, but it didn't actually have a, a picture or anything. Oh, oh, I see. It's talking about that picture. Okay, the Emperor's pointing down here somewhere. Or, or something. Um, yeah, so possibly it's actually... No, that's a flat portrait, and he's pointing down, so it's got to be... It's either sort of up here, like I'm looking, I'm thinking there, oh, there's some text. In this cemetery, look for St. Mary, for she hides the way to the place I don't lay. St. Excantium Innocenti. Look for St. Mary in a cemetery, eh? Found a secret, eh? Alrighty, now, here, now, who, which one of you is... St. Mary. I don't seem to be able to read any of these. Wait a minute. Ah. Grave of St. Mary. Yes, well, we all know that's... Okay. She, 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 she looks the way or something? Well, it's a, it's a gravestone. I don't really remember even what he said. Jeez, I'm like not paying attention. I'm just reading and it's, <laughs> it's weird and stuff. So that's that secret thing where I came in and as you can see, this sort of goes through the ground like a weird thing. She, she points the way to the place I don't... Wait, wait. She hides the... Okay, ah. Ah, now I'm getting to some place. Yes, apparently that secret I stumbled upon into... Uh, looks like the guy has fangs, but they're just cracks or something. Upon into in that one basement place was the middle part of a secret. In the darkest... Depths of hell, neath the cathedral's somber walls. Okay, that's that's where it is. Lies a chamber with a sarcophagus of gold. My mortal remains within should resting be, but my grave is empty of myself. Mayhap within should lie another. Then through the wall may the living pass. There just happens to be another corpse there. In the room of lava and of smoke, standing on the path of iron, let thou loose an arrow into the keyhole of stone. And on the cathedral's second floor, a wall of stone away shall move, setting me free. Saint Excentium Innocenti. You got it, innocent man. While I'm here, however, I should interrupt this nice little soliloquy, which I don't even know what that means, with looking in this room because it's on the way. Apparently I did miss an icon somewhere here, so somebody gave me the advice to search the leader somehow. Oh, oh. Ah. Uh, simple as that. There's their icon. It says silver gear. I mean, of course, right? Well, there you are. I guess the reason why I didn't find, um... That emperor's pointing thing 
to be the answer. Like, I knew there was supposed to be an emperor pointing, and I saw that plaque, but I didn't make the connection, I guess, because I was thinking of a... I was imagining a pointing statue or something, rather than a plaque or a, a, a portrait or something. And, you know, that's... that's it, I suppose. Trying to make this little bit of babble last all the way down. I thought I heard some chains, like a hunt. That sure would be frightening if a hunt jumped out like lightning. Okay, I think... No, this isn't it. No, it's over here further. I did take everybody out, so no need for fear. They have some sort of strange breathing apparatus, but their eyes could still be irritated by the gas, possibly, maybe. I don't know. Anyway, going back down here, because I really was even... I was even thinking of shooting an arrow into that keyhole. But I wasn't too sure, but the thing is... Oh, I thought something had spawned, maybe. The thing is, because I remembered uh, uh, you shooting an arrow into an indented hammer that looks like this in Truart's mansion, and then something opened up. So... Alright, I could hear it from all the way down here. Let's go! Of course, I'm heading in exactly the opposite direction from the black team icon, but hey... So I assume by second floor they mean actually the catwalks or something because... What? Where am I now? Oh, no, this is not the thing I thought it was whatsoever. This is where I'm trying to go here. And... Because if it's, if it's this... If it's this place, then, uh... What's that? I see... Um... That almost looks like a door, but, uh... What? What? What's... What's in there? This may or may not warrant investigation. I might be totally on the wrong track. Therefore, good thing I'm making noise because nobody's around to hear it. Okay, well, there's this mighty suspicious looking big ol' hammer here, and like, maybe I could jump up it, but no, I can't jump up it, and there's this chandelier in the way. Wait, no, that's just the catwalks, isn't it? Sure of it. Let's try. Cut for good measure. Oh, yes, of course, it's the catwalks. Now, if this is what they mean by the second floor, well, I don't know. It could be down there where those were left off that one video, because this place is rather large, and uh, there's a lot of doors around here, and it doesn't seem likely they'd call catwalks a second floor, but maybe they would. I really don't know. It's pretty weird. Uh, there's the builder himself. A second. A door? I should have gotten my bearings based on where I heard that door, because I could hear that door open when I shot the arrow, but how am I supposed to remember what's directly above other things and... Yeah. Allow me to search! Found it! This is... This is above that room where I was, so they did mean this place when they said second floor. Because... Look at... Whoa. Creepy. It's like right here. Whoa, 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 okay. Calm down there, objective man screen. Okay. Uh, you found the final resting place of Sainte Scantium Innocenti. Bonus. Okay. Uh, nice. The world was in mine hands, and now... Here I shall sit for all eternity, surrounded by my last worldly possessions, within the somber walls of this cathedral, built to commemorate my divinity. Alas, not even I, the greatest master forger in imperial history, could halt the cold hand of death. So, in my final hour, I didst tell to my scribes to seal me in this chamber, to go out just as I entered this dark world, alone. May my treasure bring thee happiness, for thou hast followed my riddle and solved it well. Saint Excantium Innocenti, I see 689. Wow. Alrighty then, still sitting upright. You know, I feel bad that I had to get 
unintentional assistance with solving that. But uh, if I would have, if I would have just like made the connection between the first portrait and that it was pointing, I would have been able to solve it on my own. Big deal. But uh, oh well. Oh, oh well. Okay, so apparently the black team icon is in this room. And there's a lone torch that somebody just uh, said, hey, put out the torch, I think. But then somebody else gave me a hint, and I just, I'll just like pretend I didn't hear the solution and instead imagine the hint, because which scroll is it? Um, hmm, was it? Well, I don't know. Allow, allow me to just read some of this stuff here. Well, the only thing that I might have found in this room that... I, that could have a hint is this the light can hide just as well as the shadows maybe that's some kind of obscure thing anyway i should have noticed this lone torch oh is well that's all my objectives that i know of well hey it's time for me to head back to the cemetery i guess there's probably some more secrets, but uh, I'm still a little curious about this water thing. Like, I understand it's realistic to have a tunnel there, but that's just bugging me. They really should have like a little thingy, like a secret or some coins or something. I don't know. But, yeah, when I'm on the way back to the cemetery, perhaps I can talk about uh, my experience with this mission. Whoops, where, uh, where am I going here? Ah, there we are. Well, I said at the beginning that the concept seemed ridiculous, you know, capture the flag, but in practice, it was really cool. No joke, no, just straight up serious. It was really fun and a really, really good concept. It's a shame that it, it seems that there were some others who were also a bit turned off by the concept, but... You know, I recommend anybody play this. I mean, obviously, if you've seen me, but just, you know, if somebody was randomly watching this without having watched... Yeah, there's, I don't know why you do that, but yeah, I mean, it's, it's a really good mission and you just, just give it a chance and you will find that it is actually pretty cool. Uh, you know, the voice acting was hit and miss, as was the quality, you know, uh, some of the, the text I still think is a little schizophrenic with some of it being really funny and black humor and others being like really dry and like, we're just going to tell you the history and just the facts and that's it, which is okay, but uh, you know. It feels, I think, that, you know, it was made by one guy and then, like, a, a several other people sort of took it over. And I think it kind of shows, but, uh, you know, that's okay. I really enjoyed this mission, and I'm glad that I finally saw it through in uh, a Let's Play, rather than continuing just uh, having not played all of it as I was almost going to there. So, yeah, it's... Uh it's it's really good, and uh, I d I never expect them to be over so soon. Perhaps I'll just save here randomly, so I never have enough planned for later. But I've had more than enough suggestions for other missions to play, so I will go through the list and just pick one. It's tilted. looking video. What are my stats? Wow, I only missed one secret. And I didn't miss that much loot either. Pretty damn nice. I'm pretty proud of myself. <laughs> yeah, so as I was going to say, I'm just going to pick one. Also, I was hoping to have this last a little longer so I could finish writing my freaking better auto automatic tool thing, but I guess that's not going to happen, so uh, 
there are many suggestions which I have to pick from, and, uh, and you know, I can only really do one feasibly, but, uh, you know, they'll all, they'll all be played eventually, because I like to play more stuff, and I guess I like to draw videos out at the end, you all know that, because, you know, it's like, uh, oh, yeah, see you guys later. Oh, I keep forgetting there's a continue button. Yep, that's an all-star team right there. Also, really cool way of seamless movingly across the images. Anyways, see you guys tomorrow for Taffin as usual. Bye.